Hey guys, we're here at Araby Acres in Yuma, Arizona, and we're going to kind of take you through the park and show you where we've been staying. Yep, for the last two weeks. Yep, two weeks. Tomorrow will be two weeks. We check out tomorrow. And we've driven around and seen all the parks, almost all of them, and this is one of our favorite and one of the biggest. So that's a keep in mind if you have a bigger yeah. rig this would be the one that you want to stay at because it's one of the biggest there is another one that's bigger yeah a few other ones they only you can't bring a 40 footer in there which we don't have a 40 footer so we're good not yet so we will uh <laughs> drive and take you and show you uh Araby acres yep. Let's do it. okay guys here we go we're gonna turn you around and we're gonna go for it <laughs> Here's the truck, and we'll go take you in there. We'll just do a little drive through. Just like that. Okay, you guys, so now this is the entrance of the park. So you can see there's rows on each side and we're not going to go down every row but we are going to go straight to the clubhouse and show you that and the pool and the dressing rooms are absolutely amazing. So as you can see the wonderful palm trees, the clubhouse is pretty big and they have a pond over here to your left. It's absolutely beautiful. And they got games here too, you guys, you can play. And there's the pond. There's the pond. So we're just going to drive around this circle where you guys can see. And we're going to get out and take you into the pool area. On to Oleander Circle. And as you can see here, there is a lot of mobile homes. Um, that permanent people actually live in so they scattered the RVs throughout the park there is a section for pull throughs that we will show you that they keep all the pull throughs in one section it's a very quiet park too The speed limit is 10 miles an hour here, and they are really strict on it, so you want to stay at 10 miles an hour or under. Yeah, we already got yelled at, and we were going 10 miles an hour. So we're going to pull off right here, you guys, and the mail room is right to your right here. And this is where you get your water and your mail from 2 to 4. Okay, we'll just pull up in this parking spot here quickly here this is where you come into your laundry so we're going to show you that first okay guys here we go to the laundry room let's go in, let's go in. It's kind of dark in here. Look at all these machines, you guys. So it's a dollar seventy-five to wash and a dollar seventy-five to dry. And here we've already washed our laundry twice, and the machines work really good. So you can come out here. You got a sink, which is nice. And this is a big pool area, you guys. Look at this. If it wasn't for COVID, this might be full. And so the pool is still open all winter long. And then you got the hot tub. Now, to me, this is a little too cold. It's like 70 degrees. I need about 85. <laughs> and you got the big hot tub here. Can you imagine how beautiful this must look in the summertime? There's the hot tub. And look at these chairs, you guys, over there. How nice is that? I can't wait to come and stay when it's warmer. Here's the chairs. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, now we'll, we'll bring it back to Shauna and she can explain to you a little bit more of what we got going on. What have we got going on? Well, you got, okay. you got your yeah. pond out there. Yeah, you got the pond, you guys. There's horseshoe games out there. And let's go check out the clubhouse. Let's check it out, guys. You got Look at Shauna's new here. boots. <laughs> she got some little new boots, pink boots on. You got cornhole games. Oh yeah, here's the cornhole games. <laughs> you got. And we got ping pong, yeah. table tennis, however you prefer. This is a rec hall, and it's closed this weekend, you guys. So it's really big in there. So sorry we can't show it to you. But we can go into the women's bathroom. <laughs> Let's go in. You have to make sure nobody's in there. Anybody in here? Nobody's in here. I'll so make sure let me take side. you guys in here and check out the bathrooms. And they're really nice, you guys. Very, very clean. You know, in the showers. It's nice. You definitely want to wear your shower shoes, of course. Those mats will hurt your feet. Okay, let's head back out to the pool. So, so far this is my favorite park, of course. So, but you guys subscribe and follow us and we'll continue to show you um, every thousand trails we plan on going to in Yuma. So today is our last day here and we're actually heading to Cactus RV park tomorrow so and then we'll show you that and that's really tiny compared to this one I don't know how many camping spots they have here maybe over 400 500 it's in the brochure everyone is really welcoming here um, and it's just been a really quiet resort okay let's go try to find spot so Hope you guys are enjoying your New Year's Eve. And we're back out here. We're gonna just show you around a little bit. I thought you were coming out over there. I didn't know where you were. <laughs> okay, you guys, I'm gonna hand it back to Scott. So we can show you some of those, those lots here. Okay, here we go. I can you show them this lot. Look at these guys, these are nice lots here. Yeah, these are pretty good sized lots yeah. here. Yeah, and they have rentals. Over here. Do you guys don't you guys just love there. all those palm trees? Oh I just, look at the palm trees, they're just beautiful, aren't they? I just love Ooh, look at them palm trees. It's like what 60 degrees? Not too cold. Yeah, not bad. So let's take them over here and we can show you that there's a grass area. Exactly. And then we'll drive around and we'll show you guys where the pull through spots are. But isn't this yeah. nice right here? So it's just And right up stuff. this sidewalk here is where the office is at. Yeah. And I'm sorry we can't get in and show you guys everything because yeah. it's so locked up with yeah. COVID. Um, but anyways, here's the office. We don't want to get them out of their chair because we just don't. <laughs> but this is the office and then the gym. Yeah, there's a gym, you guys. There's a gym here. And um, I, it's probably closed too. I don't know if they're going to be open on it or not. But oh yeah, it's open. So Voila. we'll come in here, and here is the gym, guys. It's got a sit-down cycle. You have a big weight machine here. You got the skinny guy in the mirror and the lady on the elliptical. I need to do this more often. You need to use it more. How fun you guys, right? So we're really enjoying this park life. So now we're gonna show you guys how to get out of here. <laughs> you push the door. Okay. Let's go show them. Okay, now we're gonna go drive around the park. So we'll see you guys in a minute.
Okay guys, so this is behind the office where we just showed you the gym and all that stuff. And uh, on the way down here, we've seen some people out in the middle of the road because they're going to be partying for New Year's. So we're going to go down there and talk to them and see what's going on for New Year's. <laughs> Maybe we join them. No. <laughs> well, you never know. Hey guys, this video is brought to you by the Osmo Pocket. We have no affiliation with them. I just like the camera. Yeah, we And I've got to put my seatbelt on. We need to show you guys how small it is. Yeah, the Osmo Pocket, it's a pretty neat little camera. But anyways, that's all the that's all the advertisement they get from me. So go there. Nobody down that row. Yeah, there's lots of rows here, you guys. And the pull through rows in the very beginning to the right member oh I didn't know yep must be the next one or the next one or the next one Ingrid Drive not that one Okay, we're heading to the block party. <laughs> you can see them over here just partying down. <laughs> Senior citizen style. <laughs> Senior style. <laughs> I'm almost there. Not quite yet. Only 48. I still got at least a while. 10 years. You know. <laughs> You guys look like you're having too much fun. <laughs> hey, is this the happening party spot? <laughs> this is the only loud place in the park. <laughs> you, you can join us to make it louder. <laughs> come by later because we'll be here. Okay. 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 Over. okay. Over. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Come on over. All right. Let's go to the front to show them the pull because you'll have to cut some of that out. That's fine. Yeah. Okay, now, guys, we're going to go up to the front and show you some pull through spaces. Mm -hmm. There it is. So just go up to the right and then we'll go back to our campsite. Okay, here's all the pull through sites right here, people. Pull right through there, come on. That's a big bus. Yep. And there's another row of them right there. A lot of fifth wheels. Still on the left hand left hand side here is all pull through guys. That's where your bigger rigs can go. Take you around the back side of it. Yep, and then we're going to head where we're at. Yeah, and then we're going to go back to our rig and make some pizza. Flatbread pizza. Scotty style. Okay. And here is our trailer. Here's our little home sweet home. It's a mess right now, you guys, because we're packing up and getting ready to move tomorrow. All right, guys, that was the tour around Araby Acres in Yuma, Arizona. We also want to say that um, 
since we've been in Yuma now for 14 days at this park, it's been really nice because the weather is definitely 10 degrees warmer than Quartzsite. So yeah. that's been really nice and everything is so close. And really no dust. Yeah. But we love the desert. Yeah, Don't get we, us wrong. Yeah, and we still love to boondock and we plan on maybe coming back to Quartzsite for a couple of weeks in January to see some of our friends. So we're going to go inside and cook some pizza for dinner. We got this um, Ninja Foodi for Christmas. And it's great if you have a very small space like we do and you like to cook really easily. We're going to show you how to make really good pizza that's not that fattening that because we're trying to get healthier. And it tastes really good. It gets oh God, crispy. Yes. We do it on the air yeah. crisp. And so. yeah, you don't have any dishes hardly. So yeah, so let's go make some pizza. Let's do it. Okay, let's watch that first. And okay, guys. I'm going to go show you the the things I'm using here. So we have Italian sausage. I've already cooked it up. These are called called folded. They're uh, flatbread little shells or whatever they are. So that's what we use. Olives. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and get everything prepped up, and then I'll have Shauna turn the camera back on. And while I'm making the pizza, we'll show you what we do. So hang tight. Hold it. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and set up the grill. So we go to air fry, 390. We're just going to bump that up to 400, and we'll bring it down to 12 minutes. And I go, uh, let's, go let's go 10 minutes, and I'll go 5 minutes on each side. That way the crust gets nice and crispy. So I'll go ahead and get that going. And what that does is that preheats the foodie. Um, and by the time I get done making the pizzas, we'll be ready to put them in. Okay. So here's your flatbread. And just let them know whose idea this was, though. This was my idea. <laughs> <laughs> He's so funny, you guys. This is my idea. I right. I discovered these at Walmart for a couple bucks. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna take some pizza sauce, put it on here, nice and. I don't like a lot, so just use what you like. Okay. So now we're gonna put the cheese on. You guys, this is really delicious, I'm telling you. It's so good. And I don't know how many calories, um, but it's definitely not as much as a pizza in a restaurant. Okay. So there's that. We're going to throw some pepperoni on it. Little bit of sausage on there. Mm -hmm. Some olives. <laughs> okay, get some olives here. Throw mm, some olives up in that, there. You guys. Mm. I tell you what, it, it really does taste really good. You want I'd, pineapple? Yes, I'd rather eat this any day than go out for pizza. You the pineapple? pineapple is right underneath the pepperoni. Okay, there's pineapple. And we're just using pineapple chunks. Okay. So now when this thing is ready, you guys, it will say add food. So cool. Add your food. This is the best thing I've got. Walmart has it for $169. We'll just suck. Uh, you can't, when you got so much shit in there, the pineapple and all that. And just... Yeah, we, we kind of made a fully loaded pizza here. All right, there we go. So you don't put sauce on both sides? No. So you let it go five minutes. We'll turn it and see what happens then. Okay, you guys, we're getting here, ready to flip the pizza. All right, five minutes. We'll flip it, people. All right, Ooh, look at there. It looks, it looks 
looks actually done. That's done. You don't gotta flip it. You actually don't need to flip in this thing anyways, babe. <laughs> oh, you guys, doesn't that look delicious? Oh my God. There's one pizza. Oh, and it is so good. So you pick it up like a pizza sandwich and I tell you what, it's so delicious. Okay. Number two in. Another five minutes. So you only need five minutes per. You don't gotta flip it. And you know, if you want to cut up your pineapple in little chunks, you can. Unless you, you guys. want it extra crispier, then yep. you flip it. Yeah. So. But here we just slide look this stuff nice back in. Look how nice that's cooked in there, you Ooh, guys. Look see? at that nice and crispy. Oh yeah. yeah. You just pick it up and you eat it like a. Like sandwich. a sandwich. Okay, guys. We hope you enjoyed our pizza recipe. Shauna will tell you a couple more things about it and how to eat it, and we'll go from there. <laughs> yeah, you guys. I just pick it up, but. I'm waiting for it to cool off, but it's so good. So we're just trying to find recipes that are easy to cook in the RV. So stay tuned, subscribe, and I hope you enjoyed the park. And see you next week. Yeah, so we'll be on Tuesday. Hopefully. Uh, we're a little late this week. We're a little time. late this week, but holidays. sorry, guys. The holidays really mess us up. Okay. So we'll see you Tuesday. Chance road tripping out. Mm -hmm. Bye. Okay, that's legit. Cool, this thing is so good.